What is going on, my Pilgrims? Welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2 Plus for 100%. Last time, we had a very bittersweet. And good happens on bad happen. And it ain't just sucks. Today, go do stuff. You. J. John Weathers. They call me Snow Goose now. Whatever they call you. You borrowed money off of Leopold Strauss. The bills come due. This ain't the best time, sir. This ain't the best time for anyone. Mr. Strauss knew it was a long-term proposition. The debt is due. Okay. I got supplies meant to last through the winter. You can take them. Just, is there any way you can help me? I stay out here, there won't be anyone to pay you. I ain't here to help. I'm here to collect. We're all, all of us up against it. Look, there's men after me. They're killers. I ain't a deserter, just an objector. It ain't right. If there was another way than running, I need your help. Shut up. Please. I... Up here, it's him. It's too late. Form up, we shoot on sight. I clear off, sir. Shit. Well, seeing as I'm here, I may as well protect the payment. I think you a horse. And he is screwed. It's all right, my darling. You can come out. Oh, crap. I probably should have helped you fix the damn wagon. We could probably still save something. Really now? Look, you can take the silver locket for the debt. Ah, uh, no. No. Damn the debt. Just get her somewhere safe. Go on. Thank you, fella. You know, there ain't enough kindness in this world, that's for sure. But you... I don't know nothing about kindness. Oh, a huge chunk killing that horse, that dynamite. Okay, boy. Alright, so the main reason we're up this way is we're going to go to the Indian Reservation for the first time. We have never been up this way, and it should be an interesting time. So, anything beyond this area, I have no idea what's going to happen. I'm not ready for anything. But I do have the Karna rifle now, which has been nice to handy with the 680. Weird little area. Pretty little area. Any plants or anything? That looks like the Indian Reservation. Oh, 
way north now. I'm going for a railroad out here? Yeah. You okay, horse. Nothing's gonna get you. Now, a cougar appears that wouldn't hurt my feelings. Use weapons in this area. <laughs> That's fair. They're probably like, who the heck is this white guy? Hey there, partner. This is no place for you. Is he wrong? Outsider was helping rain fall. Could be the one. Hi there, mister. You do not belong here. We have nothing for you. I'm on your side. I'm not here to ruin your day. Hey, partner. sound very well. I'm not. I'm, I think I'm dying. Then I hope you find peace. I don't know too much about peace. Apparently not. Did you have fun with my son, the impetuous prince? I believe you went on a raid with him. Um, I'm sorry. I suppose I lack the grandeur of a conventional king. I don't know too many kings. <laughs> Colonel Favors. He has already exacted some measure of revenge for the raid. Two women were assaulted by his men. Um, I'm very sorry about all of this. Yes. Sometimes the correct path, the bravest path, is the least obvious and also the gentlest. I'm... I'm a great disappointment to my son. Your son seems to want a war. My son thinks there is glory in death. Maybe he's right, but for me, I saw death being handed out so freely by the most foolish of men, I never could equate it with victory. Glory has come in service. Maybe. Maybe not, I don't know. I've killed a lot of people. For a whole lot of dumb reasons, and I ain't never seen much glory in it. Well, your friend, Mr. Vanderland, he talks a lot. I don't know him, but my son is easily lit. I'm not sure I get you. Uh, well, perhaps we could go for a ride. I'm an old man. My whole life I have tried to bring peace. But uh, I ain't doing so good. Then maybe you can take pity on my plight. Please, it won't take long. <coughs> and maybe I can help you with that cough. Sir! Hmm. I'm glad I caught you, sir. Captain Monroe, do you know my friend, Mr. Morgan? No, sir. I don't have the pleasure. Arthur Morgan. It's an honor, sir. How can I help you, Captain? I was just in San Denis. I spoke with the mayor. It's not good news, I'm afraid. 
May I ride with you for a little? Of course. Interesting. Follow me. So where are we someone going? we're kind of hating on, someone we like, and you know, person who's one of us. A place for reflection and healing. What is this news, Captain Monroe? Yes, sir. As I mentioned, I did speak again with the mayor and the Bureau of Indian Affairs in Saint Denis at length, but regrettably. It appears the oil company has already received approval to move forward with drilling on the reservation's land. I suppose there's much. So what does that mean for us now? I'm not sure just yet. I didn't get the impression anything would be happening for a few months. I'm very sorry, sir. I did everything I could. I know, Captain. And I assure you I will continue to do as much as I can. Mr. Morgan, would you have time to help me at all? I would rather certain actions were taken by friends outside the tribe. Sure, I can help. That's good news. Thank you. Come meet me on the reservation whenever you can. Any assistance would be much appreciated, Mr. Morgan. This is a weird little chain of events. It's a shame we're gonna start a war with my your people. Anyway, gentlemen, I won't take up any more of your time. I'll see you both soon. Sure. Thank you, Captain. Enjoy the ride. We'll continue on this way. I'm going to look for some herbs to give you. Wait. No, it's, that won't do anything. Probably help you ease it, but... So often we're unable to see past our own grievances. This is what I try to teach my son. Hmm. Yeah. No, yes. Good. There was no need to harm them. I love this guy. He turns on his whole thing. Mr. Morgan, but don't feel like you have to. It's a beautiful ride ahead if you need some time to think. So, I ain't exactly sure why I'm here. I guess our situations have become tangled. You mean with my son? Yes. I was there on the raid to steal back those horses and, uh, well... You know something of Dutch, I think? A little. Mostly from... Sorry, uh, hold up a moment. That'll have to wait. Some of the plants I need will be growing down here. Okay. Right. Hey, Yarrow. This is what I was looking for. English mace. Okay. Okay. Let's continue on. Okay. Now, as I was saying, a little. Mostly from your friend, Charles. I don't know why he's getting involved with Eagle Flies. But the two of them together? It's gonna be a problem. So what are you suggesting we do? Two of them were headed for Fort Wallace when I last saw them. I'll head over there and see if I can keep things from boiling over. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. You got no reason to thank me yet. So, conditions are that bad on the reservation? Yes. This conflict with... Colonel Favors and his regiment at Fort Wallace continues to worsen. Many of the elders are sick, and the young feel that any compromise is an admittance of defeat. Yeah, compromise ain't an easy thing to learn. I felt like that once, too. I was there 20 years ago for all the fighting, and I saw where it led, but my people come to me for answers. 
And I have none. I cannot even guide my own son. It is hard to tell someone who is being treated unfairly not to fight back. Dutch used to tell me that revenge was a fool's game. And now? Wait, stop here. I want to pick some ginseng. We can talk more about this later. Huh? Where the heck even are we? Who's curious? Oh, okay, I know where we're at. Where the, the legendary grizzly was. Wait there. I'll put these in your saddlebag. Okay. Mix these together. It tastes awful. But it'll help to keep your strength up. All right, let's go. It's not much further now. So, anyway, for now, Feels like he's developed a compulsion for it. Any action without violence is difficult, especially when my son is involved. But when the intent becomes violence, that's when the cycle begins again. <laughs> yeah, I've been in that cycle my whole life. I appreciate the herbs, but I think it's gonna take more than that. I saw a doctor and he says I'm in a pretty bad way. I'm sorry to hear that. It's all right. I'll work something out. If I get enough money together, I can always head out west to one of those sanatoriums in California. I still got some options. Well, <laughs> I wish you all the best. Number what? Eagles Fly, Rains Fall, Arthur Morgan, you know, good, great names everywhere. And a box. Those are peaceful little trip, but what's the catch here? Like, what am I supposed to do? I've been seeing it a couple times now, buddy. Someone who wanted to enrage you. Help me look around, please. The Chinupa is gone. Of course. What is it? A uh, ceremonial pipe. There must be some clues to what happened here. They 
The army did it. Because the flask is obviously there, unless. Come on, Arthur. Well, if they drank whiskey, all yeah. that, they couldn't have gone too far. Yeah, well, uh, still no sign of the Chinupa. I'm not drinking. Look there. Smoke. Do you have any binoculars? Oh, there they are. These brave men. Some of Colonel Favor's men. They must have been the ones who did this. Are you surprised this happened? Not at all. But... But I hope we were past this. Well, you got land they want. Land with oil. They moved us here. They've taken everything we had. I signed three treaties myself, and they've broken each one. No, Stop they've it. taken the last hope. No, my... On a war. A war they can't win. Not if I get it back. Get it back? Yeah, I'm gonna go in, get your chin up, and no one will be any of the wiser. Would you do that? Yes, I want to do that. Let's do it. Got my core, so what? Uh... Boy. Yep. You said you were going to look for the Chinumpa. We're going to. Yep. Going down the mountain. Seem nice enough. Sure looked like one. It was one of these missions. I'm not supposed to do anything to anybody. Well. 
The whole world hates me already. So. God, my core is so low for no reason. Oh, I think I didn't have a choice. I had to do that. Come on, good stuff. I need the arrows. I don't understand why he didn't just stealth kill him instead of full blown, uh. Okay, boy. Yep. Like, instead of just kicking him. <laughs> He's struggling eating those. your things I think yes thank you I'm very sorry about this even sacred things are only things people the heart matter more was anyone hurt yes it's a bad business I should not have let you do this for me but perhaps it will stop a bigger massacre but these Maybe I can calm my people. Maybe I can calm my son. I hope so. Thank you. Take those herbs I gave you, please. And most of all, I hope you can find peace within yourself. find peace in himself he's a man who not so long ago I would have found weak and pathetic now I see as wise and thoughtful and sensible I would love to help him or at least stop Dutch pushing his son to do something real stupid Back here. Yeah, I've got someone ready to do it. Oh, oh so cool. Go see Colonel Monroe, which we probably will do. We can find well, what's one of the last things I'll do. Screw Micah. And. Oh, okay. I any other random missions I can think of right now? 90. Oops. No? Well, I'll see you then.